your system comes with a whole bunch of fonts. If I go into the font book, uh, I can look and, and look around and I can see the computer fonts. That's the one that are that come with the computer. You can access all of these fonts through uh, Adobe Illustrator. They're cool. Blah, blah, blah. There's also user fonts. Those are ones that I installed myself. That one looks like Star Trek The Next Generation, which you probably don't know because you're young and potentially not giant nerds. There you go. Well, that is the font that we use to make the holodeck sign on our virtual reality room, Mr. or Dr. Harrison. I, there's, I like this font. It's called Burbank. It's kind of a fun font. Anyway, these fonts didn't come on my computer. I had to install them. So I'm just going to show you there's a website where you can get fonts for free. I'm just going to do a Google search for fonts. Uh, and oh, that's interesting. Google has its own one. I'm going to click on it because I've never seen it before. I, I want to see what it is. I, I have never seen this before. Uh, the internet is slow today, uh, leading to a slightly more boring uh, video. Oh, look at this. Let's say I like this one. What can I do? What does that do? I think maybe I can just add them to my Google stuff. One family selected. Can I download it? Yeah, there it is. Cool. Look at that. I can download that font. Let's download it. Boom. There it is downloading on my computer. So this very first video is a short video, and it's just how to install a font on your Mac. So now I open that zip file and it gives me this folder and I double click it and then I double click the font and then the font book says, hey, do you want to install that font? And I can say, sure. Boom, now I have that font. There it is there. Now I can use that in Adobe Illustrator. I'm gonna show you that again real quick because I went pretty quick. So I Googled fonts. I found this new Google fonts website that I didn't even know about until this very second. I found a font I liked. Ooh, that looks very medieval. I pushed the plus button. Uh, see, I've confused my, even myself. Okay, and then I push down here, and then the, it's it's this one. Oh, I removed it. Oh, okay, let's try again. Select this font, and then I pushed here, and then I push the download button. There it is. See, download. I'm getting a phone call, and then as soon as it's downloaded, I click it here. Oh, it's an 800 number. I'm not picking it up. And then I go in here and I double click any of these TTF files. So these are all different sorts. So let's pick, maybe I want a bold one. You can preview it by pushing spacebar. And you can be like, oh, that's the one there. Double click, install. And now it's available here. So now when I go into Adobe Illustrator, I can use it. That's video number one.